There's no hypocrite quite like a socialist hypocrite. Socialism is basically share the wealth. However, these days you will find that many of these socialists are quite wealthy, middle-aged bums who've done rather well for themselves thanks to capitalism. But for some weird reason, they're pushing for socialist policies on their countrymen. So they're okay. Everyone else, well, you'll have to queue for your bread. Or they're on social media, down with capitalism. By the way, buy my book. <laughs> so as you can see, they're hypocrites, one and all. And one such hypocrite is vile, foul-mouthed television personality Miriam Margoyles. And she truly is a vile uh, piece of work, if ever I saw one. And to behave like she does at her age, it's just disgusting. Now, I believe in uh, treating and talking to our elderly with respect, but I'd quite happily go off on one on her. She deserves it, she really does. What a truly nasty left-wing socialist individual she is. Anyway, she's in hospital. And no, she hasn't had a lobotomy. She does need one, though, desperately. And she's in hospital for something to do with her heart, if you think she's got one. But what makes her a hypocrite regarding this is that considering she is a socialist, you would think that she would uh, go on her principles, wouldn't you, and her beliefs, and go to an NHS hospital to be treated. But no. Instead, she is currently living it up in the Royal Brompton Hospital in London, which is private. Now, the Royal Brompton Outpatients Clinic is London's leading private outpatients diagnostic and treatment facility for patients with heart and lung-related conditions. So she'd have paid good money for this treatment, and the reason she has good money is because, like all wealthy socialists, uh, they don't share the wealth, do they? So I popped onto her Twitter to see what she had to say for herself. And this horrible, disgusting woman said something about having a shit. I thought, fuck me, not at that age. You don't talk like that to that age, do you? Unless, of course, you're a rabid lefty. And she has a history of hypocrisy as well. Because back in 2002, she got herself an OBE from the Queen. And then admitted she probably shouldn't have accepted due to her socialist views. But accepted she did. Because these socialists, they love uh, titles and uh, shiny trinkets, don't they? So there we go, that's where she is. No NHS service and uh, NHS hospital food for her. Only the best for Miriam Margoyles, the socialist. These people really, truly uh, just make me roll my eyes. They really do. I mean, have you ever met a real socialist? One who dishes out the wealth, shares the wealth and lives true to their ideology. There isn't one, is there? That's because socialism doesn't work. And there we go. <laughs> That's my video. Hope you like. Let me know what you think in the comments. Until the next time, look after yourselves. Have a great day. And Roger Trout.